Swim lanes and containers will allow you to organize all the information in your diagram. Swim lanes and containers separate and group your flowcharts into meaningful sections. You'll be able to use swim lanes to sort out responsibilities by person or to separate a process into specific phases. Let's start building a swim lane by dragging out a vertical or horizontal swim lane shape located in the container shape library. Once you have dragged your swim lane onto the workspace, you'll see the swim lane properties bar appear at the top of the canvas. You'll be able to customize your swim lanes with the swim lane properties bar. Properties bar will appear once you select all of your swim lanes or just one. From here, you'll be able to add and reduce lanes, change the orientation, adjust text, and change the color of the header and the lane itself. To change the header text, select the lane you want to edit, then double click on the text to edit. It is important to note that swim lanes are container shapes. This means that when you place a shape within the swim lane, it will stick and move wherever you drag it. Using magnetization can be a great solution to move a shape within or outside of your swim lane. To magnetize or demagnetize your swim lane, select the lane and then click the magnet icon that is located in your properties bar. When you are ready, you can move and resize lanes as you need. Move swim lanes by dragging them to the desired destination. Once you have placed the swim lanes where you want them, you can resize them by clicking and dragging borders. Do you need to add, move, or delete one of your swim lanes? No worries! Select the swim lane that you would like to interact with. Right click and you will then be able to add, move, or delete the swim lane you have selected. You'll be able to insert a swim lane before or after and move left to right. There is also an option to delete the swim lane. Adding a container is another great option to group your information together. You can find your container shapes to the left in the container shape library. Drag and drop a container over any information on your canvas that you want to group together. Once the container is placed, you'll be able to adjust the size and move the container as needed. Remember, once you place the container over your information, or place information in a container, it will become magnetized. This magnetization can be undone and turned on by clicking the magnet icon in your properties bar. By using swim lanes and containers in Lucidchart, you'll effectively be able to organize and bring clarity to all of your Lucidchart documents.